five to hundred psi to start with. And now the fun part. Let's operate this baby. Put on all your safety gear. That means a respirator, leather gloves, and eyewear. Turn on the power. Attach the work clamp and know exactly what and how you're going to cut. Secure the starter switch in one hand. Pull the trigger and air begins to flow. Place the tip onto a bare spot on what you want to cut. Press the high voltage starter switch. As soon as you hear the electric arc start, let go of the switch. And then you can just cut the metal any way you feel like you want to. Here you see we secure the switch. Got my thumb on it ready to use. Pull the air trigger. Let's just do a little test pop here. Pull the starter and it works. So now let's cut a line. Let's do something a little more fun here. Nice, smooth, perfect cut. Then turn off the torch. Never touch the capacitor or the electrode in the torch without shorting out the capacitors. You may want to add a 1 mega ohm resistor for safe bleed down. Here, uh, we can cut quarter inch flat stock it with no problem. Uh, the amperage being pulled is 37 amps. Here, we're cutting a water heater that's about a quarter inch thick and it cuts it with no problem. There's more of a problem dragging the tip across the rough, rusty surface than there is for it to cut it. The smoother, steadier the motion you make, the smoother the cut. And a nice smooth cut. 316 stainless steel plate. It cuts like it's not even there.